coming out. Just a character I've been seeing a little bit more frequently from them. Uh, but we're gonna get the return. Oh, God. <laughs> Some audio alerts are coming in from uh, ships of the ear holes, unfortunately, but uh, a very high frame data matchup between these two. Jeez, okay. Uh, which I'm excited to see. I mean, this is a, definitely a more of a boxing match when it comes to be it. both players being able to get, get with hits, get kind of two or three piece combos, but at the same time, uh, a pretty quickly paced match when it comes to just be able to dash around and um, just increase the speed as they kind of adjust to each other's gameplay. But yeah, like just like what we're seeing now, it's more of like kind of constant reads, constant pressure. Both players have very safe moves on shield and uh, that auto cancel very easily as well. But uh, quick down tilt to four there is gonna be a good spot to put Brozak in for the sledge pressure. Uh, but neither stock didn't get off just yet. Really not too much damage accumulation for the first minute. Uh, both players kind of just feeling each other out. Down tilt up smash not going to connect on the ledge like that, unfortunately. Uh, but a low call out for Brozak. And man, oh, just barely missing the back air there as Chips and Tilera dodges through it. Oh! <laughs> just trying to... A will Brozak into approaching into that uh, Mario up smash, but down to a quarter is going to connect at that percent. Maybe just catching chips. Unable to DI and react is such a quick option, but uh, stock advantage going to Brozak there. Oh. Okay, down throw into up air is going to connect. Going to call the DI in. That makes sense to me. Uh, as. Of course, if you're going to get thrown by Mario, you're assuming that you're going to get thrown out to stage, but a down throw covering just so much. You know, when you're able to like, throw out another aerial out like that. And back air, hopefully, Chips didn't use his jump. Okay, nice. Going to make it back regardless, and back to neutral, just back to the footies, and yeah, up smash out of shield. Very good option for Mario, though, to see things out. Combos coming out too. I mean, very reminiscent of Smash 4. <laughs> Just getting like PTSD. That was such a ridiculous combo you could do with basically any character. All right, but I... Oh, the counter not connect connecting either. Alright, playing with the log a little bit too. It does extend some hitboxes, so it can make things pretty interesting. And really, we're seeing chips slowly coming back. And that's the issue once again. I mean, Greninja can struggle to kill once you're outside of those combo uh, percentages, so... Character diligence when it comes to us saying, Okay, I play Greninja, I can get my combos uh, that link to kill from like 90 to 110, but outside of that, I know I'm gonna have to get chip damage to 180 for a, uh, an up throw to finally take the stock off, so... I mean, if you're patient enough, that's fine. Uh, but good on chips for avoiding uh, Rosex kill combos of... From that 90 to 110 to not lose a very early stock ended up surviving to 180 i mean that's a, a very good feat to have i mean definitely brought himself back in the game down are gonna connect it to neutral air too wow parry up smash and we're back to an even game as well I'm, by the pace of this i wouldn't be surprised to see saw a game five or just a really close game uh like 3-0 uh one of those ones is like yeah it was 3-0 but i mean it was super close right I'm uh, just hoping to see if uh, Chips can seal things out and instead of continue to just play from behind as he has these last three stocks, uh, maybe he can run away with more advantage than he's been able to so far. Right, well, down throw, not going to connect anything there. Uh, just continuing to play at this percentage where Rosak just needs to get enough chip damage to where up throw could finally take a stock off or random whiff hit with back air or up air like this, they're sharking for. Okay. Slash off opportunity, gets a quick combo. Not gonna get a forward air out of it though. Unfortunately, yeah, obviously Chips is for, for Brozak looking for that throw that's gonna take it off the top of this percent for sure. Uh, but Chips really 
does have the opportunity here with so much Mario Rage uh, that they could steal this game back. Oh, Mario forward air on shield is not saved, and that throw is finally going to seal it out. And game one going to Brozak. Alright, so on chips is counter pick. I'm assuming, or I wouldn't be surprised if we stuck with the Mario. Uh, but at the same time, chips can play lots of different characters. And we are going to get a music choice for Small Battlefield. Nice. Uh, I've just been seeing more and more recently that we have some pretty solid connoisseurs of the Smash music. So uh, the preferences are key if you do have them, right? Uh, but we're going to continue with the Chips Mario. As we go to Small Battlefield, and <laughs> both players didn't get their uh, color swaps, unfortunately. <laughs> Alright, but pretty solid footsie so far. De oh my gosh, down throw to forward tilt. Or, or down throw to yeah, forward tilt to forward air. Just instant decision making there from Chips into what well, almost felt like a, a zero to death, but uh, Grozak has a really solid recovery with Greninja. He's gonna be chilling at this point, and we're really just kind of throwing hands for whiff hits at this point. Alright, well, back to the footsies. Place and play from both players. Chips shaking it their head for some reason. I'm wondering if they're just missing putting on a dash or something, but yeah. I think a couple of missed inputs for Rozak there too, but the deep offstage back air is going to seal that first stock out. And that was actually pretty, pretty early stock taken, especially for uh, Chips being out of the percentage to get the clean combos, but Rozak's being able to pressure very well in, in, in general with these aerials. Down throw working out once again. I, I'm just not seen even a grenade just do down throw combos. I don't know if it's a DI mix or just a matchup check where uh, you should know whether or not you're going to air dodge out of it, but at the same time a lot of players know, hey, if I neutral air dodge it's usually ending up, ending up uh, frame jumping myself if I'm panicking. Uh, but just a turnaround up smash is going to seal it out and bring it back to two stocks of peace. Nice parry there from Chips. Chips starting to dial in some of the timings for sure, but we're not going to get too many big opportunities out of it. It's going to flood off stage. We'll just say that was a timing mix-up. Uh, down to a forward are not going to connect either. That's one of the very limited options that Brozak has at this percentage. Uh, but even at that, if Chips DI's correctly and it mashes a defensive option like John for neutral or dodge, you could avoid the forward air as well. Uh, not going to get a big ladder combo though. And recovering high this time. Rozak was ready to call out the low recovery with the back air once again. Wouldn't be surprised if he went out there once again. Yep. Uh, looking good. And forward air going to connect? What in the world? Sometimes that forward air feels like a sword move. Chush, what was the set count? Okay. Uh, around that corner, yeah. Alright, well, the stock lead once again for Brozak. And the side special, kind of a quick matchup check. You need to be shielding or waiting or just essentially drawing out that option. Uh, but Chips gets hit by it anyways, unfortunately. And, okay. Both players going back to the footsies. It's been more, it feels like more like lift hits than anything else. We need than either player being able to like set up long these long string combos that honestly both characters are able to do but it might just be coming down to the fact that neither player has been able to open each other up well enough to get something started like that all right solid aerial coverage there from Rosak, just anti-airing while chips is in the air but both players went back at the ground game and that's where greninja thrives and the down tilt up smash is going to connect All right, so a 2-0 lead for Brozak so far. 
And we are going to get a character swap from Chips to going Joker instead. I uh, might as well mix it up while we're in round robin pools especially. <laughs> Taking a second too, we're not going to listen to game audio, back to getting our own jams. I totally respect as well, but... Ooh, the purple Joker skin? I like that, it's clean. Alright, but right into a really solid early percent combo though, with three up airs bringing us to 40%. Uh, Chips does have a very solid Joker though, I mean, uh, it's a very, obviously a very good character. But at the same time, uh, it does have opportunities to open up some big combos too. Uh, it's really, I mean, you can play Joker so many different ways with how, uh, how many different mechanics he can work with. He has those guns, so you can camp out and just get slow accumulation damage. We obviously have our Sen, which gives Joker insane framing data, but the like damage and knockback of Ganondorf. And wow, Brozak gonna seal out the game there, or the first stock there with the down tilt up smash once again. And that just reminds you that hey, you have to look out for that option when you're at that perfect percent point. Just be cognizant of what your opponent's kill options are at different percents. And there's only a few for Greninja, uh, but that was definitely a really good call out for Brozak to seal it out there. Uh, going back to the footsies, Prozac's been doing such a good job of just controlling the ground. Uh, a lot of dash attacks have actually been, been linking well. It might be coming down to the fact that Chip really isn't even shielding much on the ground when it comes to expecting hitboxes. Oh, the down air gonna connect! Yeah, Chip's expecting it that time and showing that, hit. hey, I'm, ad I'm adapting, I'm learning. Really, Greninja is a pretty l linear character and really that... Uh, Counter into the side special is going to do 47 damage. That's insane. Alright, well, things pretty much even now after the just solid advantage state that Chips had in the second stock right out the gate. Uh, I've still got uh, Brozak's first stock, but uh, offstage pressure. Both players kind of just playing around. Oh, kind of a straight foot still there, but yeah, new neutral air for Ninja is going to be safe on shield and. Kind of just tracing trips his defenses off there gets another down tilt to up smash all right down throw is not going to connect anything at this percent unfortunately but yeah joker setting up some kinds of kill options i mean we have the forward air into up air drag down for smash attacks and such but our send being out too we have even more options just needs a couple straight hits uh, of course the classic joker thing that they love is the down air into pretty much anything uh, to take steals off but dang really good angle there from Brozak to avoid uh, getting offstage hit by Joker but yeah an up smash is gonna call out and seal out that stock we still have a fourth of the Arsene meter but yeah just two hits there Arsene's gonna be gone and basically a second here yeah and things looking a lot more even I mean Brozak's been doing a really good job against base Joker uh, yeah Chips just really hasn't been able to open up much of Brozak nuclear in general with base joker barely gets out of that up air drag down i don't know if rosak maybe messed up the input but down tilt up smash is going to take the third and final stock there for a 3-0 <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but a, <laughs> yeah but a 3-0 for rosak there as we continue into uh more stream sets of round robin pools we'll be finishing up very soon here i think we have yeah, I know. They're, they're all up there. Uh, Ford versus Razzy on stream.